Hey you guys, I'm at Rainforest Cafe. I love it so much. The fish tank's over there, I'll show you guys that later, but we always used to eat here when I was a kid. If you guys haven't been here yet, I got my Disney hat, by the way. This is my first day that I'm bringing this. I got it from Disney World, it says Jack on the back. It was expensive, especially to get the embroidery, but I just want to give you guys a look at what it looks like. The fish tank's all the way down there. They have like a huge ash fish tank. And they also have like animals. There's a storm at one point. Uh, my family's over here. We probably have to wait. Do we have to wait? Wait inside the store. They take your name down and a big elephant head over there. I'm wearing my Boy London shirt. I got it last year. Well, it wasn't a year ago. I got it a while ago and it was like 60 bucks, but it was on sale, so that's why I got it. But it's my first time actually wearing it. It was in my closet and I never wear it because I'm always afraid I'm gonna get shit on it like when I'm eating or something. So hopefully it stays white. The restaurant's just back there. But they have all these fish, there's Dory. This is like one of those restaurants where I don't know if you guys go where, I mean the food is whatever, like it's not the greatest food you're ever gonna have. I mean it's good, it's expensive, but like it's one of those atmosphere restaurants, like the place in Pirates of the Caribbean, which we were gonna eat in Pirates of the Caribbean, that like blue bayou or whatever it's called. Sorry, I had to say that quietly, but um, we couldn't, there's my mom. We couldn't get reservation. So after waiting like 10 hours, just kidding, it was like five minutes. We, they finally, the servers called our names and we climbed these stairs and I felt like an Aztec prince, a, a jungle king, a jungle god climbing the stairs where all the animals of my tribe will have made me a feast. So you guys are right by some gorillas. <laughs> They're on right now. Right There's also a waterfall right here. So we haven't ordered yet, but here's the thunderstorm that I was talking about. Oh, uh, well, I don't really know. You guys... Yeah, that's their lightning that they have. And the whole restaurant goes dark, as you can see. The animals go crazy. So here's the... I got a burger. It's like a barbecue burger. And okay, let me... Be, okay, how the fuck... There's my hat, by the way, back there. And how the fuck does anyone fit this thing in their mouth? There's a pickle back there. I can fit that thing in my mouth, I promise. But like, this burger? Really? I had to like cut it with a knife and fork and eat it. And then we went to Disneyland and this is all the footage I got. I know, I'm a terrible vlogger, I'm sorry. But that's all that I vlog. Uh, but okay, you guys will understand, I'll explain in a second. You guys, so look what my mom, look what my mom gave me. She gave me a little, she gave me a little bunny. They actually just left, um, I just got back. We spent the day in Disney, like I'll throw up um, some footage that I took. But like I didn't vlog that much because we were back in, um... Disneyland and like it was so busy today some of the rides were closed like we were waiting in line for Finding Nemo for a really long ass time and then they like kicked everyone out of line because it was it like broke down but my parents just flew back to lovely Pennsylvania which is sad I don't know but I can cuddle with this bunny she also gave me those starburst candies that are so good <laughs> she was like we can't give you an easter basket this year show so i got you some candy and a bunny and i was like oh thanks mom but oh, i don't know you guys like i'm starting to well it's not i'm not starting to i've been missing home a lot i don't know like i love california like i love um just like the energy that's out here but for all of you guys who are trying to like leave home or go somewhere else because you're like fed up with living in whatever small town you're from I don't know you can never I guess truly replace home I at least that's my experience like um, home will always be home because this doesn't feel like home when I was at Ithaca didn't feel like home I don't know and you always, like, I, I have the desire to go back home. And, like, that's why, like, my parents are like, we might move. We might move to California or we might move to Florida. Like, then where's my home going to be? You know, there's not going to be that, that place to go back to. Because I feel like your home's always where your childhood was. Even if your childhood wasn't that great. It's just weird. Maybe I'll have a mental breakdown one of these days. But I'm just editing this footage already for this vlog. And I'm already like, oh, 
I miss my mom, I miss my dad, I miss my brother, I miss them, I miss home. Like, one thing that I noticed, like, and I'm sorry, like, I'm, I'm ranting and I'm going on, but I remember the first time I left for school at Ithaca and I was gone for two months before coming home for fall break. It was, like, the greatest feeling to come home, and I remember, like, the doorknobs felt weird, like, going into my house, like, everything was unfamiliar, and I know everything's gonna feel so unfamiliar about going home, but it's crazy. I don't know. Life's weird. And it's weird because you're you you're gonna reach the point where you don't want to leave people behind. Like you don't want to be like I'm moving. I'm leaving all my friends. But like if you stay, you can't do that either because they're gonna leave. They're gonna leave you behind. You know. So it's weird. Life is weird. But I don't know. I'm graduating, you guys. I don't want to have a mental breakdown now. That's not what this is supposed to be about. It's just weird. So, I don't know, my parents flew home today. Mm. Anyway, tomorrow's vlog will be fun. It'll be lighthearted, I guess. Not that this is like a Debbie Downer vlog, but it's, it's, I don't know. But anyway, you guys, I hope you enjoyed watching Disney. This is the last time you guys are going to be seeing a Disney vlog for a very long time. I'm not going to be blogging about Disney because I'm not going to be going because I can't afford paying $200 to go to Disney. But my roommate's probably home. He's probably back from going to the pool. So I'm going to say bye to you guys. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. I don't know what I'm doing, but hopefully it's something exciting. So bye, guys.